everywhere I go, I see his face. I just really miss him. Yeah, I miss him too. I don't think Tony would have done what he did if he didn't know that you were going to be here after he was gone. <laughs> You gonna be the next Iron Man now? Well, no, I don't have time. I'm too busy doing your jobs. What? Oh. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Look, keep up the good work. Because I am going on vacation. <laughs> Heads up, Nick Fury's calling you. I don't really want to talk to Nick Answer Fury. Answer the phone. Why? Because if you don't talk to him, then I have to talk to him. I don't want to talk to him. You sent Nick Fury to voicemail? I gotta go. You do not ghost Nick Fury. What up, dorks? What's up? We're just talking about the trip. I'm here in St. Marco Polo's. Oh, I think MJ really likes me. That reminds me when I first fell in love. You're a very difficult person to contact, Spider-Man. This is Mr. Beck. We could have used someone like you on my world. New world? Beck is from Earth, just not ours. A snap to our hole in our dimension. You're saying there's a multiverse? We have a job to do, and you're coming with us. Maybe someone else you can use. What about Thor? Off world. Captain Marvel. Unavailable. But I'm just a friendly neighborhood Spider Man. Bitch, please, you've been to space. What do you want, Peter? I want to go back on my trip with the girl who I really like and tell her how I feel. MJ, I am Spider Man. No, of course I'm not. I mean, it's kind of obvious. You're right, you may not be ready, but this is my responsibility. Saving the world requires sacrifice. Sometimes people die. Oh my God. I just always feel like I'm putting my friends in danger. The world needs the next Iron Man. Are you going to step up or not? I work with Spider-Man. You work for Spider-Man? I work with Spider-Man, not for Spider-Man. New plan. <laughs>